and we are back with more action here on MW Satin. Coming down to the ring is one of the surviving members of the Purple Thunder Empire, Rachel Starlight. You're probably wondering, how come we don't see Kapenj Mabula or the Mega Hill Linus Mizami escorting her, escorting her to the ring? Because it's like this. Kapenj Mabula has called Linus Mizami to Japan to not only help out the victims of the earthquake, but to do a couple of wrestling shows for a couple of Japanese wrestling organizations. What I'm also told is that Linus Mizami is going to be in a very special match against Akira Hokuto in one of the um, Kinzuki office wrestling events. All I can say is good luck to Linus. But until then, let's prepare ourselves for this match involving two women that know each other very well. I'm talking about this woman that's in the ring right now. The Purple Thunder Paladin, Rachel Starlight. And she's gonna go up against this woman. She is one half of the Dragon Sisters, along with Phoenix Blacksmith. She is the Fallen Angel. The Fallen Angel, Amber Nyhart. Yep, N Amber Nyhart. I think, I believe she's either the cousin or the sister of, of Natalia Nyhart, but irregardless, her and Phoenix Blacksmith make up the Dragon Sisters. And tonight she's going up against one of her rivals, Rachel Starlight. Yeah, she may be a bit athletic, but in a way she's downright <laughs> sexy. Yes, indeed. Both of these ladies are gonna put in a great, put on a great match here for you guys. Something you do not want to miss, because there is something wrong with you if you do miss it. Referee calling for the bell. Both of these ladies start things off with an elbow tie-up. Headlock applied into a hurricane runner by Amber Nyhart, trying to put in a, a flipping senton. Hmm, not bad. A reversal by Rachel. Another reversal by Amber. Another one by Rachel. I think both of these ladies put in a great effort. I think that was a Enziguri executed by Rachel. Now Amber fighting back. Until Rachel puts in that Irish whip to the corner. But she got planned. Ooh, putting her upside down to the tree of woe. Because now she's going to put the foot onward to the throat of Amber. Man, this match is getting very sick. Hurricane Rana pinned by Rachel. But Amber was able to get the shoulders up on that one. Also later on tonight, in the main event we're going to see Makoto Ishikawa go up against Phoenix, not Phoenix Blacksmith, but the new MWE Women's Champion Penny Stokes in a non-title match. DDT executed by, by Amber Nyhart as she shows off her sexiness to the crowd there. Rachel slowly getting up and kicks Amber into the abdomen. Puts a nice little arm and grapple. Attacking the arm. But before we get to the main event, there's a match that's already been added. Tiffany Hilton will be going up against WWE Diva Eve Torres. And here's Rachel Starlight with a Hangman DDT. And into a springboard senton. What she got planned for for Amber here. Trying to go for a springboard senton on Amber but misses. But wasn't able to miss that hurricane round of pin. Referee counted it. One, two, only got two. Man, that was close for Amber. And she was able to execute that that face crusher. Now she's on the outside putting in a trying to go for a senton move but misses. Man, both of these women putting on a great match here. Not bad of a hip toss. Putting in more punches. Irish whipping her to the corner. Not bad of a net breaker there. I go for a standing moonsault. A standing moonsault. And now she goes up on top. About to go for what appears to be a leg drop but misses. Both, both ladies are out. But Amber was able to get up 
first. And now going back on the attack on Rachel Starlight. Putting pressure on the knee and the legs of the Purple Thunder Paladin. Yeah, the Dragon Sisters and the Purple Thunder Empire were at war with each other. But I guess the war in itself will intensify now that Phoenix Blacksmith is now the new MWE Extreme Women's Championship. I mean champion. Well, I said championship. I don't know why, but regardless, Rachel Starlight gets hit onto the outside. And Whoa. Amber Nyhart with a outside dive onto Rachel Starlight. Two. Showing off that extremeness. Three. Man, not bad of a, of a modified move on Rachel Starlight Four. as Phoenix Blacksmith not Phoenix Blacksmith but Amber Nyhart mm, gets kicked to the abdomen for all her troubles mm, not bad of a takedown by Rachel Starlight as she is now back in control here but Amber put in those swift kicks and a, and a side effect she's ready to end this ladies and gentlemen Phoenix Blacksmith I mean, Amber Nyhart, many apologies, setting up the Chaos Theory. The Chaos Theory on Rachel Starlight. And now Amber goes for the cover. Two, three. And she gets the three. Amber Nyhart with the win on Rachel Starlight. He put in a great effort in this match, but in the end, the Fallen Angel is victorious. We will, we will be right back with Tiffany Hilton. Don't go anywhere, folks, because we will be right back.